Cosmologist Max Tegmark seems to be fond of radical explanations of reality. And it's no different when it comes to maths. Instead of just accepting mathematical order in the world, he's been trying to figure out why it exists and where it comes from. And he thinks he has a solution. To me, math is the window on our universe. It's the master key to understanding what's out there. I wouldn't say I'm completely monogamous with equations, but there are just a very few I love the most. I love them because they describe exactly what's going on outside the window in our universe. These equations describe how light behaves. This equation describes how gravity behaves. This equation describes how atoms behave. These equations describe what happens when you go really fast near the speed of light. And it's just amazing to me that a little bit of scribbles like this can capture the essence of, of what's going on in this very complicated looking universe out there. Galileo way back in the Renaissance, already remarked that nature seems to be a book written in the language of mathematics. This all came after Galileo, so why are we discovering even more and more mathematical regularities out there? What is it telling us? I think our universe isn't just described by math, I think it is math. I think our entire universe is a giant mathematical structure that we're part of. And that that's the reason why the more we study physics, the more mathematical regularities we keep discovering. Max's theory pushes at the edges of physics and into the realm of philosophy, conjuring up the oldest question of all. What is real? I think the universe is a mathematical object. It's just out there existing in a sort of platonic sense. It's not that it's existing inside of space and time, but space and time exist inside of it. And that really changes our perspective. And that really means that uh, reality is very different from how it seems. If Max is right, maths isn't a language we've invented, but a deep structure we're gradually uncovering, like archaeologists. An abstract, unchanging entity that has no beginning and no end. As we peel back the layers, we're discovering the code. Strange as it seems, it's a comforting theory because if reality is a mathematical object, understanding it might be within our reach. If I'm wrong, it means that fundamental physics is eventually going to hit a roadblock beyond which we just can't understand reality any better. If I'm right, then there is no roadblock and everything is in principle understandable to us and i think that would be wonderful because then we will only be limited by our own imagination <laughs>